The Next Age of Uncertainty – How the World Can Adapt to a Riskier Future Written by Stephen Polaz Published by Alan Lane Canada Polaz has written a big-picture analysis with concrete policy ideas for what both business and the public sector should do as we move into the next age of uncertainty. The Next Age of Uncertainty, the title, comes directly from John Kenneth Galbraith's The Age of Uncertainty, which was published in the 1970s. And well, the reason he wrote that book was because of the dreaded 70s, the way the whole economics seemed to not able to explain what was going on, stagflation and all that. And so he said, well, we're going to have to rewrite economics. And that's exactly what happened in the late 70s while well, I was a grad student. I'm saying that almost the same thing is happening again. Those forces, the same ones that did that, are happening again. They're interacting, and we're going to have to rewrite economics again. So it's the next age of uncertainty. He describes the five tectonic forces, demographics, technological progress, inequality, indebtedness, and climate change, bringing the five strands together with insight, accessibility, and anecdote. So I started thinking about the things that economists often think of as constants that don't really change. It turns out they're all in motion. And that gave me the five tectonic forces that are in motion. And then I realized that actually they're all getting stronger right now. So we're entering an era where they could create a lot of volatility by interacting with each, with each other, like the tectonic plates of the Earth's crust, causing earthquakes. Because we're just not prepared for the kind of future that I'm describing. Uh, we, we're not even saving up the money that we spent during the pandemic. At a minimum, we should be paying that down so that we're ready for the next bout of volatility, but also building a more resilient kind of safety net system, a uh, system that's automatic, so we don't have to have special sessions in Parliament to get something done, uh, that, that really stabilizes the economy on autopilot. Well-written, clear, and focused, this book is necessary for anyone with an interest in our economic future. Polaz stresses that uncertainty is here to stay, and we must learn to incorporate it into our policy making. I think that's what we're going to need in the future, and unfortunately, the forces interact with politics to cause more polarization, not less. And so I'm skeptical of government's ability to actually do this, but I'm still hopeful that the book will have an impact. The Next Age of Uncertainty – How the World Can Adapt to a Riskier Future Written by Stephen Polaz and published by Alan Lang Canada. Well, first I'd like to thank the Donner Foundation for including me on this prestigious shortlist. It's a true honor for me. I've been a policymaker all my life, and the Donner Prize has real meaning. I'd also like to thank my wife, Valerie, for her over 50 years of support and encouragement and wise counsel. And I should thank Amanda Lang for encouraging me at an early stage and opening the doors for me, introducing me to Rick Broadhead, her agent, now my agent. Thank you, Rick. And finally, the folks at Penguin Random House have been fantastic throughout. The editor of my book, Nick, Nick Garrison, was fantastic, and my publicist, Shona Cook. The rest of the team are terrific to work with. Thank you.